Nice shirt, who shot the couch? Today we are doing, for Jason, there's no I in Monsoor, supporter of the cause. <laughs> Thank you, Jason. Uh, that song, by the Rock on Tours. Bored and raised, that one. The opening riff, start on G2 and pull off to open and end up on D4. Think of this as three sets of three. So G2 open, D4. The second set of three is G open, D4, D2. And it's a different rhythm, of course, and we'll get to that. And the third one is D4, two, open. And then the little end bit is D2. Second time is almost the exact same, but you just end up on D2. So, both of them together. And then the very last time you hear the finger pull off from D2 to D open before they hit an A chord. It's, it's eight beats of A counted this fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you play four beats of D, four beats of C, but the D, I'm hearing an A in the bass, so you want to strum your A string as well, or you don't have to, it doesn't matter. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and then two beats each, G, E. One, two, one, two, and then it ends with eight beats of A, and then it starts all over again. guitar riff comes in and you're, you can do it, if you do it here, uh, you can do both parts fairly conveniently. There's another guitar that chimes in with just, right? But if you do B15, bend it, and B13 in this fashion, and then you're going to make a little A chord on the 14th fret, just as you would on the 2nd fret, and it's the exact same thing but an octave higher because uh, 14 is 2, as 12 is 0. 12 is the octave zone, so... And then similarly, when the singing starts, uh, the, the other guitar comes in with just but there's a bass going along and you don't want to not play. So I would personally grab an A chord and just be chuggy with the low notes. And that E and B string on the fifth fret. The chorus is the chord part, the eight beats of A, the, the four beats of D and C, and the two beats of E and G. No talking section. That's it. <laughs> There's a. Uh, I, I thought I heard super nitpicky, but um, for that for for that part, I thought I heard the G string second fret in there as well. So if you're chugging away, you want to make sure you want you get all three of those strings. Uh, the solo is just the band chugging away in A. Well, the lead guitar solo is in A minor pentatonic, so you can do your 5, 8, 5, 7, 5, 7, 5, 7, 5, 8, 5, 8, or an octave higher. 17, 20, 17, 19, 17, 19, 17, 19, 17, 20, 17, 20, and then he kind of ends up back on his riff. But then he ends up using, towards the end of the solo, the G string 14 and 12, and the D string 14 and 12. Right? Not that particularly, but those notes, and then they end on A. <laughs> and that's it, so when in doubt, 
Play A. Jason, thank you so much. Everybody else, thank you for being here. I hope that was helpful, and I will see you next time with more stuff. Goodbye.